hey guys welcome back to our youtube channel in this video we are going to discuss how you can add call to action button in your dv wordpress website here you can see this is my demo website first of all i can log in and after that let's go to front page then enable dv vl builder now here you can see dv builder is loading and after that now let's add build from scratch and then we can add a new row then here we can search for a module call to action just click here and after that here you can see this is demo content just you can add your own content for example website design service and after that this is button text but here you can see there is no button available just we can replace button text get service and after that here you can see this is demo text description if you want to add some images in your content just you can click and after that click add media <clears throat> so then you can upload image from your laptop and I have some images here in the media library then I can select one of the image and after that just click on the image then we can align this image in the center and also if you want to add a gap just you can add cursor here then press enter here you can see space is added on the top you can also add space from the bottom just click here after that scroll down then click here link so now let's add a link for example i want to link this button with this website okay now here you can see button is showing and then button link target so by default it opens in the same window if you want the button open in your tab just you can select this option then even you can link entire module so for example when someone click here then it will be redirected to this link and here we can change the background now here you can see this is by default background color then go to design tab and after that we can customize the text text alignment text color so by default this is light we can change into dark light color looks perfect and after that we can add text shadow then go to title text <clears throat> so here you can see in the typography we can change the font font weight font style as well as text alignment and color and then here you can see text size we can increase or decrease text size and then line height option here you can see it will add some gap on the bottom side and here you can see letter spacing so it will add spacing between these alphabets then here we can add box shadow then body text and then here you can style the button just you can enable for the custom styles then sizing spacing as well as you can add border around the module then box shadow and after that here you can add animation to your call to action 